The Reserve Bank has lifted the official cash rate by 50 basis points for the third time in a row in an effort to slow inflation. Some homeowners are now looking at breaking their mortgage rates early and refixing to avoid a higher interest rate down the line. Zane Small has a story. Buying a home is notoriously out of reach for many Kiwis, and with interest rates up again, the goalposts have moved again. It will actually affect me quite a lot. Just have to be realistic about what you can buy. The Reserve Bank announced today it had increased the official cash rate to 2.5%, as spending and investment demand continues to outstrip supply. The central bank said it will continue to lift the OCR until inflation is within its target range of 1 to 3%. Inflation is currently at 6.9%. The most popular mortgage term is one year these days and it's now almost a year since the Reserve Bank started hiking interest rates and those mortgage rates started to move. So there wouldn't be uh, too many borrowers now who haven't either already been affected or who are expecting to be. One of them is 21-year-old Liam Patton, who, like many first-home buyers, has never known an interest rate outside of 2%. At the moment, my interest rate's fixed till next year at 2.95%. So looking at a potential doubling of my interest rate is, like, scary. It's going to be maybe about 700 bucks a week extra. He's now considering breaking his mortgage rate early and refixing it now to avoid a more painful hike down the line. Advice he's taken from his dad, Bruce, who's a mortgage advisor. We've had a lot of inquiry about, is it worth me breaking now and fixing it? And it really comes down to if, you, if your loan's coming due probably this side of Christmas, it's worth thinking about. If it's due next year, then realistically you're probably better to wait. Making matters worse is rising food costs. StatsNZ data out today shows grocery prices are up 7.6% compared to the same time last year. The Reserve Bank's lifting of the official cash rate is one of its main tools to curb inflation. What we hope is that we don't see them go too far the other way and, and, and push the rates up too high. An uncertain time for first home owners and hopefuls, no longer having the advantage of the early pandemic era interest rates. Zane Small, News Hub.